Hello everyone. Just wanted to give you an update on the uh, Wonder Gun Rod for the 22 caliber. Uh, a couple things I wanted to tell you about for those of you who, who uh, have watched my videos. Um, for those of you who haven't, I'll, I'll kind of touch basis on what I'm actually doing here. The Wonder Gun Rod is unique. What it does is it passes the patch through the bore and it gives you 360 degree cleaning. What's unique about it is the tip of the Wonder Gun Rod, either end you use, they're both the same, grabs the patch and holds on to it and it allows you to work back and, th back and forth through the bore giving you 360 de degree cleaning. For those of you who have been watching and following my videos, it's now available in 4, 5, 6, and 7 inch for the 9 millimeter, 38 caliber, and 357. So you can take a look at that on the website. Uh, they should be available here in the next day or two on the website at fixvictory.com. But I, just, I came across something kind of unique. For those of you who are really frugal and don't want to have to buy patches, I was walking through the grocery store about a week ago, and I don't know why I thought of this, but I thought, you know what, I just wonder if paper towels would make a good gun cleaning patch. Well, they really do. In fact, the one that I recommend using is the Viva and it says on there soft light cloth which it really is so you just tear a sheet in half and what I did was I cut some gun patches that you see here all different sizes on my paper cutter because I don't really use that paper cutter for anything now you can just use a pair of scissors but I use the paper cutter because I get nice accurate cuts so I came up with all different caliper patches so we're going to try it today and show you how it works so I'm going to go ahead and brush down the front of my barrel, you can see it's pretty dirty. It's about 300, 350 rounds through it, so it's filthy. So I'm going to go ahead and wipe that down. I took the front sight off because the powder is actually creeping up around the sight. And I'm using my mineral spirits. Same thing I use uh, when I clean the frame of my gun, my slide, my bolt. And then I'm going to be doing a video showing you later down the road, especially on the Victory. The front of the barrel, you'll, you'll notice that sometimes you can't get everything off. Well, because there's little spots of lead up there that are melted. And if you get too aggressive with it, you mar the finish on the barrel. So I'm going to show you a video how you can soak the barrel, especially using the ultrasonic cleaner. Like I use the ultrasonic cleaner to clean just about everything is you can remove all of that chemically with the parasitic acid the same way that I uh, cleaned my compensators so I'll be doing a video on that and also it'll remove the burn ring in front of the chamber and the back side of the uh, back side of the barrel okay so now that we wipe that down we're gonna go ahead and run our bore brush through and just soften up that fouling and Mineral Spirits, if you're watching for the first time, Mineral Spirits makes one of the nicest gun solvents. Very inexpensive. And I use the Odorless. The same thing I use to clean the other parts of my gun. So I'm going to run that bore brush through. The more you do of this, the less amount of patches you're going to use. And by doing this, you really eliminate the bronze brush. Since I've been doing this, I haven't had to use the bronze brush at all. Okay, now that we've done that, we're going to go ahead and we're going to try the... Uh, originally, I recommended using the outers, 7 8 inch by 7 8 inch, 100% cotton patches. But, I think that the Viva Paper Towels, we're going to start with a 3 quarter inch first and then we'll try our one inch and see the difference between the two. So I'm going to go ahead and run a three-quarter inch through and we'll start on the chamber side. And shoot and goes through nice and smooth. And what's nice is that little tip grabs the the patch or the paper towel or the uh, 
cotton patch if you're using cotton. And the Viva paper towel, believe it or not, seems to get, get into the lands and grooves a little bit better. Now I'm going to go ahead and use the one inch. A little bit, nice tight fit. So I would say the three quarter inch or one inch, same as I originally recommended on the outers. The, uh, the originally was the seven eighths inch. And if you make your own, you can cut them seven eighths or one inch. But I have to say the uh, paper towels are a hit. After doing this, I don't think I'll be buying these anymore. Not only to save the money, I can just custom cut whatever size I want. Especially now that the Wonder Gun Rod comes in different sizes for different calibers. And I'm going to be doing a video on the 9mm Wonder Gun Rod and then try. Normally, most people use a 2 inch patch and you put it through the slotted tip. And, it, you know, that, it gets expensive too. Plus, environmental wise, this is a lot. A lot more environmentally friendly because you're not using using that much material. And what's nice about the Wonder Gun Rod is it's 360 degree cleaning, unlike the slotted type tip that you run through. And you can just run it back and forth. So that's two patches. Now at this point, I'm going to go ahead. and run a little ballast all through. You can use your frog glue or your hops number nine or whatever you want. But I'm gonna run a little ballast all through, finish up. Now I'll check the bore with my eye loop. See how clean it is, but it should be spotless. Well, I have to say the Viva paper towels are, they're a hit. They work great. And I'll follow up with one more dry. And that's it. Now all these patches or two sheets. So I would imagine that entire roll for a buck ninety nine on sale. I bought two of them because I just had a feeling that they were going to work really well, and they do. They seem to get down into the lands and grooves better versus the woven cotton. And that's probably a lifetime of patches for this gun. And if I don't use the entire roll, I'll pass it on to my son. How's that? That's it. Let's check that bore. See how she looks. Now I'm going to use my eye loop and get these at Harbor Freight. Just hold against anything white like this paper towel. And that's perfect. I can follow the rifling from one end all the way to the front with no obstructions. Yeah, that's that's slick. Okay, for me, I'm not, I don't think I'll ever be buying another gun patch. So <laughs> this is pretty exciting. So anyways, the Wonder Gun Rod now is available in four, five, six, and seven inch for the nine millimeter, 38 caliber, caliber caliber the 357 all the same rod and the uh, paper towels I wanted to share that with you I think that's pretty exciting so anyways uh, good luck out there and uh, give the Wonder Gun rod a try and save yourself some money have a great day